Welcome to your Cohesion Classroom. In this lesson, we will take a look at how to count and order numbers one through five. At the end of this video, you will have access to our tips and takeaways, allowing you to focus on the content being presented. You could always access any of our tips and takeaways from the lesson page before or after watching this lesson. As students begin to learn the numbers one through five, they will need to recognize that the numbers are going in order and become larger as you count. Each number can be shown with a visual to represent the value. Let's take a look at how to order numbers one through five using a picture. Count the objects and write the number. Let's start with one box. The next number would be two. As I continue to go in order, the next numbers will be three, four, five. Notice the tower of boxes are getting larger as they are counted. The visuals help students learn to count in number order. Let's take a look at another way to place numbers in order. Count the objects in each group and write the number. Then write the numbers in the correct order. In this example, students are shown existing towers of boxes one through five in an incorrect order. Students would have to count the boxes and write the number below each group. Now students need to write the numbers in the correct order. They would need to find the smallest number to begin the sequence. This would be the number one. Write the number one to start the correct number sequence. To find the next number, look for the visual that shows one more than the number one. This would be the number two. Write the number two next. Continue these steps to finish the number sequence in the correct order. Students should begin to recognize the numbers in the correct order without the visuals. Students are often able to count consecutively from one to five. However, miscount objects when they are being placed in groups. For example, if a group of four apples are shown, students often lose track of the objects they are counting, which results in an incorrect total like three or five. As the objects are being counted, encourage students to use their pencil to cross up the object or move the object to the side as it has been counted. This will ensure that the objects have been counted correctly. Students can create their own pictures at home and draw them in number order from one through five. The skills used in this lesson will be applied in our Represent and Compare Numbers to 10 lesson set. To gain a full understanding of this concept, visit the lesson page to view the rest of the Represent, Read, Write, and Count numbers 0 through 5 set of lessons. Uniting students and families in learning we are Cohesion Education. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.